Hello everyone and welcome back to Belagar Ironhammer, the true lord of 8 peaks. And I am so happy that we got an episode 6, because in normal fashion, two days after I started recording this series, we got another hotfix and everything broke. And it seemed to happen a lot lately, and it's really frustrating, but I don't want to sound ungrateful, because it is great that CA is finally keeping the game up to date, but it is also really frustrating as someone who uses a lot of mods. But at the same time, that is the cost of using mods, I suppose, and I should just back up the mods I'm using in my campaign locally. So at the end of the day, it is my own fault for being lazy, and I'm just venting at this point. So ex excuse my rant, and let's get back to settling grudges, because uh, we got a grudge settler army to do that more efficiently for us. And we're about to kill Skarsnik, so we're just gonna keep going here. And we should probably just get you closer. We can use you to help us with this little thing here. And that is a pretty free win, I think. Because we've already won this fight once, so... We're gonna take that. 65 losses is nothing, and uh, these guys barely took any damage. Wait, did you still got to do <laughs> a lot of kills there. Alright, I'll take it. And we're gonna just occupy that. And we get it at tier 2. Ooh, that gives us prospectors. I want some of these. They're like... Elite miners, <laughs> and uh, we have uh, evidently used a lot of miners. Just look at that damage. That is really good damage, and their ammunition is magic. That's weird, but <laughs> I guess I'll take it. So, oh, oh wait, that's wait. We have something that does that. I forget what that is, but we got something that does that. <laughs> right. That's fine, but we're gonna get ourselves some Prospector here, and uh, they're gonna be cool. We're gonna have them on the front line, and they're gonna be elite guys. It's gonna be great. Skarsnik is dead, and uh, we're just gonna put on our marching shoes with our new Grudge Settlers here, and go and hunt down some Skaven, because we got flamethrowers for that now. And I'm gonna want some flamethrowers here. And we're doing pretty good on money now, all of a sudden. We got some industry here. That's pretty good. We're probably gonna grab the control and replenishment. Yes, so we can recover a little bit. We can uh, stabilize this whole place. And... Um, let's see, you had a good... Alright, we're not gonna get to you in a while, so we're gonna ignore that. It's not even that good. But you had a good thing, because you give us money, ingots, growth, and I guess winds of magic? I don't know what's that gonna do for... <laughs> <laughs> but that's fine. We got money and ingots. That is a lot of money to spend for it though, but that's gonna be good. But we should probably spend, uh, well, at least one of those. I guess we do it in this one because it's way better, better defended. So that's gonna be good. And you just got rank 12. So we hold that, or we take that, we grab that. And now our miners have 11 ammo. Yes, nuts. And I love that um, that so much. That's gonna be great. Uh, we don't need that. We are just gonna keep get, getting triangulation. Keep grabbing Woodmaker. And I guess you have a thing to grab as well. Ooh, Aura of Endurance is pretty good. Yeah, it buffs everything around you, and you got pretty good stats already. So, I just want the buff, I think. Oh, and we got two. So, do we have a new? We got some corollars and the hammers. I guess we do the just shooting thing. You're always gonna have some shooting. So that's gonna be fine. And, um... We did take this last episode, so we're just gonna march, like, I guess we can just march over to you, just sit in that fort, and we might just underway over here and start murdering stuff over there, because we're just gonna sell this to these guys. Let's see, it is Munzig. Let's do that. Uh, holy shit, they <laughs> want everything. I think we're just gonna grab a defensive alliance in that case. Grab some trade and uh, take as much money as you give us. So be it. Hell yeah. That is excellent. Yeah, alright. In that case, we can afford more industry here. Start making 
Okay, actually we should we should grab the extra growth. All right, we're not taxing this, so we're getting some extra growth here. And we're not taxing this, so we're gonna get some extra growth there. That's gonna be good. And uh, once we've taken uh, Karakate Peaks and healed a little bit, we're gonna start doing some quests. So I think that's gonna be great. But that should be everything that we can do, so we're just gonna pass the turn here. Uh, Alright. <laughs> I forgot about you. But we got more Slingers over here attacking Karagnar. Alright, well, there's nothing we can do. Oh my god, you guys got a lot of kills there. <laughs> Alright, well, they're not gonna take it in Skaven fashion, but that's fine. Oh, we got another quest. Hammer of Angrund. Alright. Well, uh, we'll deal with that eventually. And oh, right, that's you. That's okay. Oh, are you are you building that over here? Probably not then. So, how far can we get with that? And uh, all right, seems like we're getting further with you. And I kind of want to just stay within this place because we're getting decent replenishment here. Oh my shit, that is a lot of stuff. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, we're gonna kill some slingers here. That is a decisive victory, so let's take that. And probably just... Uh, probably take the old golden money. And we go and sit in here and defend this. Because I think we can just defend this for a while. Well, I guess Belagar can go and take this. Because this is the last peak, yeah? Yeah, so we're just gonna go and take this, and then uh, we can just jump over, start killing them from behind, and just have a good time. Yeah, and there is a lot of grudges to settle over here. That's uh, gonna be great. We've only settled 2%, and that's 600. <laughs> that doesn't seem right. Alright, that's fine. You've done your thing. We don't see any of those guys, so yeah, we'll pop on over there. And let's see if we're just dead here. But I would like to start murdering these guys. So that's gonna be good. And I think we are gonna start building some kind of uh, outpost here, just to be able to get some cav. But nothing seems. Well, you have some. And it is a capital city. I think we're just gonna build up some uh, some allegiance before we start doing anything like that. See where we build it later, because uh, I would like to have it in their capital if they build that up. Ooh, although they are under attack here. But they should be able to handle themselves, right? Yeah. And do you not control this? You should be. Oh, right. This is just from confederating the purple dwarves. Right. So you need to keep leveling that up. And oh, right. I should. I did change the name of uh, one of our uh, regiments of renown here because we lost the orc slayers. So I made the orc exploders, which is a dumb name, but I like it. <laughs> and. Wait, are you... Yes, you are attacking. Okay, so I guess there was an army inside the city. I thought at first we got uh, like an underway interception, but it just says battle. So I guess we're just going to fight this normally. They do have play class, which isn't great for us. But we do outrange them slightly. So we'll see how this goes. Alright, so we are still fighting in the... Oh, shit. Okay, I didn't mean to do... Well, that's fine, honestly. Um, so let's grab these guys. Set up like that. And uh, I guess we just move up a little bit. Just so we can start shooting these guys right away. Move you up. And uh, they are marching towards us, though. So that's good. Maybe set up like there, maybe. So I want to start murdering them. 
They will be here in a minute. So we're gonna get some shooting and uh, hopefully we don't have to worry too much about their catapults here. Because we can send these guys up a little bit and kind of just tank this entire force there. Yeah, just start throwing your shit. We'll move up a little bit. We do have lots of shooting and not a fan of that, uh, that balance there. But we're getting some good damage right there. We should move you over there. And you are shooting stuff, so that's good. Yeah, there's, there's some very dead rats though. Uh, you should start shooting these play claws right away. And that is, that is a blob right there. Actually, start shooting in there. <laughs> we need to, we need to attack into that blob. That is a very good start though. And we do need to hold this. But uh, the Longbeards are gonna do some really good work against uh, clan rats and Skaven slaves. So that's nice. Alright, keep throwing your shit. Oh, the Lord is there. Excellent. So, we got big, big debuffs here at the very least. Oh, did we? Are we locked down? Okay, I think we were locked down. Alright, fight this guy. Debuff everything. Get a big dam or attack boost. You can sit there and fight. You sit there and fight. You sit here and shoot. And yeah, you're, you can shoot whatever you want here. And yeah, just shoot into that blob. That's fine. And we should be winning that. We should be winning that. You are actually taking quite a bit of damage, but you're also killing these guys. Oh, you need to move back and throw your last things. Please kill the warlord if you can. These guys are dying, so we can get in. Okay. Lots of clan rats here. Hey, good dodge. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, you're gonna have to put in some work here. Uh, keep pulling back and we are killing this guy so we might just route him off the map which is kind of huge so get in the rear on you because if you route off the map then uh, that's gonna be a big leadership debuff for the rest of their army here and I mean we are dwarves we hold this we hold this like champs so start shooting in there start shooting over there help up with that and the Lord is running off. Haha! -ha! Suck it, nerd! Okay, you need to break there. Oh, shit, these are breaking off too. Those are breaking off too, which is not great. Go and fight over there. Um, you keep shooting over there. We are winning over there. You need to come back and help out with that, because these chieftains are a pain. But chase them off at the very least. You're routing, so please kill these play clock catapults once and for all. Routing a lot of rats off right there. Um, start shooting at you. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, you should be routing off there. Excellent. So, now we're not surrounded anymore. Now we can go and help with these uh, assassins. That's pretty good. Start shooting those guys. <laughs> that's a, that was a good volley. But um, we, mm, that's not good. They're gonna... Okay, you need to route off here. But you're running off. That's excellent. We have dealt with you guys. So let's go and kill them. You have run much too far. Let's go and fight over there. You're routing off. Excellent. You're gonna come back eventually. Please shoot you. And when you come back, you shoot over there. And hopefully you can deal with that. Alright, we need to shoot you. Can't let them route off our stuff there. Get on top there, get on top there. And you are about to route off here. Well, almost. Come on, Longbeards, you can do this. You are great at this. Get that buff. Oh, that hurts a lot. Holy shit, that's painful. Yeah, that is not good. 
Well, you're doing all right. And you're getting some help here, which is great. Yeah, we lost you. That's not good. Oh, you come back. So shoot these guys. Oh, chase these off. Don't let them come back and then you go and help over here. You're doing fine just tanking like a boss. You've almost dealt with this chieftain. Make sure they don't come back if you can. Yeah, sit and shoot. You are gone. Now you go and help. Okay, actually, go and help with that so he is freed up. And you are routing. Okay, beautiful. We have turned that around. Beaut okay, there's army losses even. All right, that was beautiful. <laughs> that was so hard. I was pretty unsure if we were going to win that most of that battle. But we got there. And I will take that. All right, so the miners got really beaten up, but the longbeards <laughs> and the iron breakers were amazing. But MVP was definitely the grudge throwers. And oh yeah, fucking put it on that guy. That is excellent. We are gonna take the replenishment here, and uh, hopefully we can just waltz in there now. Nice. All right, I can't wait to actually get over there to end these guys. Because we are going to go there real soon. And is it... That's not 4%. Wait, is that 4%? That's a 20th. <laughs> That's... No, that should be 5%. I guess it's slightly less than 4%. Or slightly less than 5%. Alright, so... We can't reach it like that. I'm okay with them if they just come out to fight us with their garrison, so we're just gonna go and sit right there. Because th I don't think there's anything they can have with a full stack and the garrison that will beat us here. So that's gonna be fine. Demon Slayer. And... Uh, oh, are you... Right, you guys are fighting! Right? No. You were fighting one of the... No, wait, right, it's the other guys. It's the ones who just... We're living there beforehand. All right. So, what are you? Let's have a look at you. We can take that. There's a lot of hammers, and we got some iron drakes and shit. So, yeah, we can take that. That is mostly scaven slaves. All right. So, oh, you can actually, yeah, we can. Do do we sit back and just shoot though? Alright, I feel like that was a lot of thoughts at once. <laughs> uh, we can either just sit back and shoot, or we rush one of these. I think I kind of want to rush them. And in that case, these guys can defend our grudge thrower. So, I think we're just gonna... yeah. Oh, wait, we can mix these a little bit, like so. Just drag a long line of Dawi. Put you in the center, I'm put you over there, and put you over there. And we're just gonna go. So, let's... Okay, they're actually coming to us, so... No? Alright. In that case, we're gonna move up. We're gonna just use this choke as much as we can. And we are gonna flame these suckers. And we're just gonna hold these back. I guess we should go on this side. But I don't think it matters. We're just gonna sit back and shoot. It's gonna be fine. And yeah, you guys just... Uh, set up the clog over there. And just go over there. Get ready to flame. It's gonna be great. And you just get ready to hold this off. We get reinforcements in 30 seconds. Alright. Oh, hello! Well, we can shoot back against those guys at the very least, and we do have uh, tiny little mini shields. Well, it is 30%. It's not the worst. And you just conserve your ammo a little bit. Just make them come a little bit closer. Okay. Reinforcements in... Oh, did I? No, I did not expertly dodge, dodge that, because they <laughs> are not shooting that. Alright, so you go up here and start shooting. Actually, you can start shooting as soon as you can reach that. 
You guys, just run down over there. Get there as soon as you can. It's gonna take you a while, but that's fine. Okay, now you start flaming in there. Because now we got a beautiful blob. So now we... Okay. The flames doesn't seem to be doing what the, what the effect says it's doing, but there's some good damage. That is beautiful. I love Iron Drakes. And we're just gonna bathe these rats in fire. And they don't seem to be <laughs> going forward any. That's great, because we are just slaughtering these guys. Oh, we are flaming our own guys, though. No. Okay, okay. You need you need to go and fight over there with these slayers. And uh, you can just go and sit right there and just keep shooting. Keep shooting. It's gonna be fine. Get ready over there. You can shoot at whatever you... Actually, let's go over there with you. And you go and hunt you guys down. Get in there and fight. Because you are... You are being lightninged. So let's start shooting over there with you and over there with you. It's gonna be fine. And shoot over there. Well, you broke that already. That's beautiful. But now I want you to shoot right here. Oh, and that's gonna be... That's gonna be a lot of damage. And we got some grudge throwers at the same time. And here comes the reinforcements. Beautiful. So you're not really doing anything. Let's surround you. Actually, you can you can probably chase the. No, there's no way you. There's no way you're gonna keep up with that. So just stay there and fight. Kill this guy, and then we hit them over there. We are. Yeah, okay. We are just slaughtering these rats. So keep at it. Uh, right. There's nothing left back here. Good. And you don't have any abilities. You have an ability though. But it only affects lords and heroes and you definitely can't reach that. Alright, that's alright. So, please flame over there. And, oh, shit! Oh, oh, no! No! Don't even think about it! I guess we can uh, grab a volley over there. There we go. That's gonna break them real quick. Uh, I think we can blast these guys a little bit too. You're pretty dead. We can start shooting over there and uh, I think that's army losses. Yeah. Nice. That was pretty good. Oh, right. You are unbreakable. So... and so are you. Well, no, but you are rampaging. Well, I guess that makes sense for a grudge settler unit. But let's... Uh, oh, we killed Lord. Sweet. But let's help out with some bolts there. That's uh, gonna be fine. And have I ever mentioned how much I love flamethrowers in, <laughs> in every kind in this game? That is just beautiful. And we got a dragon helm while we're at it. Alright, well, um, I would like to get some replenishment on you so you can keep going, but that is a lot of oath gold. I need... <laughs> I want that oath gold. <laughs> You're only temporary anyway, it's fine. And is that just... Skaven Slaves? Can we just... Uh... I guess we fight this one too. <laughs> but I guess we can just cut this down a little bit so it goes faster. Where... Oh, there's the reinforcement! Oh! Oh, he hello! <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, you can sit there and shoot at these guys for a little bit. But they're going to be here in less than two minutes. So we just uh, send in these guys and uh, just flame these guys to death. It's mostly Skaven slaves, so yeah. These guys are just going to hang out there, I suppose. Are you attacking? No. All right. So we're just gonna wait for him, and uh, I'm gonna cut this up a little bit so this goes faster. All right. Here they come. You can just uh, start doing your thing. <laughs> oh, I love that so much. Uh, just go in and murder these guys. You go in and murder these guys. You just focus there. 
And you just focus over there. It's gonna be fine. And just bathe the Iskaven slaves in fire. Shoot in the flank and just... <laughs> oh, wonderful. Yeah, shoot in the back. Are you winning this, though? I think you are. Especially with a little bit of shooting. Yeah. And we are winning that. And we are just barbecuing these rats. Oh, shit. Okay, nope. It looks like they met the front line. But they didn't. Let's go and send you into monks. And now you're starting to kill your own stuff. So please don't do that. And now we can start flaming on this side. <laughs> oh. Flamethrowers. So yeah, we just walk around a little here and there <laughs> with our flamers and just murder them one by one. Like so. Or, I guess not one by one, I mean like a hundred by a hundred. <laughs> oh shit, um, let's go and flame over there if you can. Because these guys seem to be... Ah, never mind, they don't need any help. And there we go, just casually racking up 1.3 thousand kills. And I guess now we can take the replenishment. We need this guy to keep going, because uh, it's so good for just momentum. Like, do we think they have anything in here? Oh, that is a city. But I mean, we don't get any replenishment with these guys except from fighting. And we already moved you, so I guess see what's in there. Okay, yeah, maybe not that one. <laughs> um, can you? Okay, just get up over there. It's gonna be fine. But yeah, I don't think we can fight Queek, this guy, and the garrison. So. We'll wait for Belagar. It's fine. We're in no, like, huge rush. And these guys are swarming. Oh, shit. They took this. I hope you can live this. Oh, you're you're running away. Well, that's annoying. Ooh. You just kind of ran away, huh? Oh. <laughs> Alright. We got so many medium-sized battles in this one. Alright, but um, they do have artillery. How many models do they have? Okay, they have five. So I think we just uh, line you up here. Oh, we are missing one too. But that's fine. We're gonna line up over there. Just uh, hold you in the front line. Are you new? Yeah. What did you get? Oh, mil damage reflection. Neat. <laughs> well, you go on the front line then. Uh, you just hang out there. We probably just put one of these back there just in case they menace from below us. Although in SFO they seem to be mostly just putting up their menace from below in their front line. Like so. So we're just going to sit and uh, shoot at this play clock catapult. And they're just gonna dance back and forth with it <laughs> all right that's all right we're gonna we're gonna hunt you down I suppose so we'll just grab all of these and keep moving up alongside it and I mean we can we can take their front line here okay well we should kill these pretty quick so this is fine and uh, like our volley with the satchel charges with you should be fine. So there it goes. You should be pretty much dead. Well, mostly at the very least. And you are still shooting. No, that was just the last volley. Okay, good. So you can stop there and just uh, sit there to shoot. And I guess we're throwing a couple more volleys over there. And, uh, yeah, I guess just move you up on the flank in that case. Getting some more satchel charges. Getting some more of those. That's gonna be fine. And, yeah, 
Yes, go and meet these guys. Oh, never mind. They're just walking into the front line. Good. So pop that. Start murdering you. And if you got another volley, shoot it over there. Yeah. We'll go and murder you. And uh, here comes more. Where, where were you? Alright. Well, that's a really good uh, artillery volley, though. And I think we can just speed this up now. Oh, shit. There's more. Oh, uh, but wait. There's more. <laughs> uh, you should go and kill the Lord, though, even though the Axe of Karakurn is dealing with this. But you can deal with this much better. Just get in there and swing your hammer around. Because you should go down pretty quick here. <laughs> and I just love seeing the grudge throwers just annihilate some rats in the background. Yeah, just speed this up a little bit. Go and fight you. Go and fight you. You can, I guess, go and fight you. Oh, shit! Uh, where the hell did you come from? Oh, you sneaky son of a bitch! All right, go go and fight there. We'll uh, we'll kill this with our with our shooting, I suppose. And I feel like you should break pretty quick, because the rest of the army seems to be kind of breaking, half breaking. Some of them are breaking. Actually, just keep going in there. You're fighting, and oh god damn it! <laughs> All right, well, at least they're not chasing them. It's fine. Stay there and fight. And they just keep coming back. There you go. Alright. That was... Uh, that was just... Annoying. <laughs> that was fine though. Alright. So it seems like they just had a lot of menace from below. And I kind of didn't count on that. <laughs> That's fine. We're going to occupy that. And... Uh, I think we can afford grabbing some units with them. But it seems like they might have just slaughtered all the dwarves over here. Oh, another banner of eternal flame. That's nice. I hope... Um, um, wait. What is his name? What is that name? It is Ungrim. I hope Ungrim is okay. And he has not settled a lot of grudges. We can almost confederate a lot of these guys. Hmm. Yeah, you have barely done anything. I don't think we're gonna do that, though. If we were gonna do it, we're probably gonna do it with Thorgrim, but... Uh, yeah, we'll see. Alright. Well, we can't uh, catch you. But we can grab some of these. Maybe we grab, like, a flame cannon? Some corollers would be nice. I mean, you are gonna fight Skaven. We have seen what Iron Drakes do. So, let's grab an Iron Drake, I think. And we can just flame them. And that's gonna be fine. And I guess just grab two more. I think mean, we can grab three more. That is gonna th be 300 extra. That is pretty much all of our money, but that's fine. There's still a couple of uh, places that we are not taxing. So that's gonna be alright. Are we taxing this though? No, but I think we m maybe can now. This is mostly Karag... Well, not mostly Karagate Peaks. It's faction size and collected income. And we got this going already. Alright, well, I think we can start taxing that again. We can't really afford to build this up anyway, so that's okay. And do we want to start taxing this? Because this is going to grow in control anyways. So I think that's pretty good. Although, we want you to grow. And... Um, well, you're about to get to tier 3. Alright. Right. I think we're gonna tax you in that case. You probably... Aren't gonna be taxed? We 
don't need the growth right now here either. But we kind of want you to... Why is your... So bad. Caracade Peaks and... Uh, faction size. So mostly because we don't have just a control building there. So that's fine. Oh, and we finished that. So miners are better. I do kind of like that. I would like this. But we already have... Well, we don't have it for all of our lords. But only... Only Belagar, and uh, this is gonna be pretty nuts with Belagar too, because he's just gonna have infinite blasting charges. But I think just warriors and longbeard defenses is pretty good. We're always gonna have that, and we're probably gonna have more like longbeards and warriors than we're gonna have. Uh, Longbeard's great axes and warrior's great axes and shit like that. Although the old guard is there, and they're pretty cool. So yeah, let's uh, let's do call to arms. Make our dwarf warriors better, because that is uh, gonna be like a pretty basic unit that we're mostly gonna have all the time. Oh shit! Well, that's not good. At least that's not Queek's army. So that means Queek is either not reinforcing or he's not gonna get to us in a while. Or we might lose this guy here. So let's just fight this. Alright. So where are you? I mean they're obviously right here and <laughs> already casting spells. But I'm not allowed to react. Alright, so... This can't be everything, right? No, not with that <laughs> that balance. Okay, so I guess uh, just drag a line like this. Just try to get in a... Okay, well, let's try to take this hill over here. We'll uh, move back with you if we can somehow do that. And you fall back. Not sure if we can do anything like that. No, that's not something we can do. Okay, pause. <laughs> Let's start flaming you and uh, we're just gonna boop. Go over there. We, we need to go and fight this. Uh, you can still take a position over there. You really need to get... Oh my god, that is a lot of damage. And that is some fast damage too. Please don't flame your own guys, so flame over there. Don't get hit by lightning. It's also a, like, a, a tip. <laughs> Pro tip, don't get hit by lightning. Uh, let's go and fight this Grayseer, or... Well, you can start shooting you. Okay, duel this, uh, this guy, I suppose. Flaming a lot of guys, so that's nice. Start flaming you as well. And maybe we can... Oh, there's Scott Gub... Scott Gubtail. <laughs> Uh, maybe we can do some damage and win this just real quick before Queek get oh come on <laughs> before Queek gets here and maybe we can do something here I I really doubt it but you never know we could uh, we can pull something out of our ass I suppose at the very least we should be able to do some insane damage and then Belagar can just finish these guys because I mean. We have killed a lot of rats with these guys already, so... Oh, I shouldn't have uh, interrupted that volley. But let's get some flames on you. Did you just... Uh, yeah, your lightning strike. Oh, that's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. Alright, just shoot what you can. Flame what you can. Try not to lose any models here. And just hit these guys in the back. Just break them, please. We are doing some reasonable damage here. That is all. Okay, never mind. I don't think we can win this. <laughs> I think this army is dead. And we are just doing as much damage as we can. So, shoot some grudges over there. Oh, that's some, that's some good shit, though. And I mean, at the very least, we're doing a lot of damage here. So, this is going to be easier for Belagar. That's uh, that's our goal here. 
And we are killing these guys fast. Yeah, so let's have these guys start breaking. Let's kill you. These guys just uh, swarm in on these two guys. Make sure they die. You need to get out of there, though. But this great seer is going down fast. And... Yeah, that's a lot of damage. So what's the best choke we can do against Queek? I mean, we can probably go here, but they can... Yeah, they can just go up on the high ground. Yeah, so you're shattered. Let's uh, try to get on you. You're shattered, so let's focus... Oh, come on. Stop that. <laughs> oh, it's an assassin. I thought it was another unit of something. But yeah, that is a lot of clan rats and uh, other gross things. Okay, well, you're dead. You shouldn't be able to do much before you run. And you should be coming back here. I don't know why you're attacking something, but whatever. And if we can just make sure that you don't come back, it would be great. Oh, this guy is really big. Look at him. That's a big ass fucking rat. <laughs> Holy shit, Ska. You need to lay off the protein, I think. Alright, let's uh, get you into position. Let's get you into position over there. Ah, let's keep trying to get you though. Well, Sky is going down. So, we're just gonna fast forward a little bit here. Alright, Sky is dead. You're broken. Okay, don't... Oh, no, don't... Don't rampage. That's... That's not what I want you to do. And you can start chasing that. But you can start shooting into these gut runners. So, line up. These guys. Like so. Don't flame Queek on his own. That's... That's, that's not gonna do anything. We focus on stuff like clan rats over there. You come back. Oh, stop rampaging. <laughs> Why are you rampaging? Warp some skirt. Okay. Um, so these guys are the rampagey guys. No? Oh, it's the hammer rampaging. Yeah, because they get into stage two. That's why. Alright, let's box you a little bit. Send you in there. And uh, just start flaming some uh, clan rats. But like I said, we I, I don't think there's a, a way we win this, but uh, we can at the very least do a lot of damage here. Oh, you're almost breaking. That's, that's beautiful. And you are doing insane damage, so... That's great. That's just wonderful to see. Oh, um, we need to make sure you don't get into our shooting here. So you're breaking. Please break. There we go. Thank you. Might have to fall back a little. Oh, hey. We got more uh, slayers over here. Uh, shoot over there. You're doing fine. Keep shooting. Let's flame you. Get in on the... Oh, that's Storm Vermin. That's not good for us. Alright, go and fight over there. We'll uh, flame these guys. Queek is killing our lord. That's not good. Oh, let's get off flank on these and get a Storm Vermin. Okay. Okay, dang it. Okay, they killed our lord. That's not good. That's not good at all. Let's get a flame on there, and we might just start breaking here thanks to that. No, don't don't go into my flamers. Okay, fine. Try to go through. Uh, try to go somewhere. <laughs> you just need to to uh, swamp it. You tarp it. That's the word for it. And you flame the storm vermin. There you go. We have broken through there. <laughs> <laughs> Not that it matters. <laughs> oh, and here comes the flanks as well. So, you're doing great damage. 
We are flaming these storm vermin now, so that should be a good boon. We might have to turn you around there, and you're actually doing amazingly against Queek there. So turn you around and start flaming you, because you can't let you get into our grudge throwers. Shoot you in there. We're doing some good damage. Don't know where your flames are going, but uh, that's fine. That's some good damage. Let's get you into Skaven Slaves. And you are actually breaking Queek. That is... That is beautiful. Yeah, break these Skaven Slaves, please. Shoot them a little bit, just so we can maybe get them to break. Yeah, you can keep shooting there. Come on, you're Skaven Slaves. You shouldn't be able to hold. Oh, you gotta love how tenacious the dwarves are, though. Just look at this. So outnumbered, so outgunned, but we are holding. <laughs> Not for long, though. Let me tell you that. Oh, you're gonna break just in time? Yes, 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 yes. Break, 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 break. Yes! <laughs> oh, here's more. Uh, let's start shooting down there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Flame over there. We got Slayers coming in too, so hold them down. Ah, shit. These guys are swarming. <laughs> Holy shit. Come on, hammerers. Hold. <laughs> hold. <laughs> oh, this is amazing. This is absolutely stupid. And I am here for it. So get a flame in there. I think with these guys going down and Slayers running out, I think that's it. But that was a valiant fucking stand. That was amazing. That is one of my favorite losses I've ever had. <laughs> but that's... that's game. Uh, concede. So, for a mostly unwinnable fight, that was pretty good, I think. <laughs> so yeah, we did lose. We did some significant damage at the very least, and we killed lots of rats, so that's gonna be fine. They are instantly going to start that siege. Alright, that's... Oh shit, wait, where is this? Um, well, that... Oh, it's... Uh, dang it, that's... Uh, the mountains. It's not in the Blackfire Pass. Alright, well, we might have to go back and deal with that. That's okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, so... Yeah, they went instantly after this. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm assuming we can't do that. But they're not attacking right away. And uh, I was really hoping... Ooh, movement range, that's nice. I was really hoping that we could get the last peaks today. And we can. I'm just gonna take that. Because <laughs> I'm not waiting anymore. And that is all of Karakate Peak. Finally. We even got a new Regiment of Renown. So, what we get? We got... Ooh, is it these guys? Yeah, immune to mountain attrition. I think we already were. Hit point speed, physical resistance, and strider. Alright. I guess that's fine. Nothing amazing or anything. But, Karakate Peaks captured. Now we just have to hold it because <laughs> they're instantly starting to attack it again. But, we should be able to just underway over here next turn. If they don't take it then, or during the turn pass, then uh, we just take it back. And I thought we were going to get some kind of a thing here. All right. Well, at least let's have a look at your thing. So that's not that good. That's pretty nice, though. We just get some replenishment. Very expensive. But yeah, we're just going to underway and take this. And that is a complete Karakate Peak. But the fight is not over yet. Because we need to kill Queek. And he's only got two settlements, so probably that and that done. Nice. 
We have done the quest that is uh, fight Quick a couple of times, right? Yes. Probably a while ago. That was this one. Yeah. Okay, but that, but that was just money anyway, so that's fine. And... Okay. <laughs> I mean, I was gonna underway over and kill these guys. And they're just gonna keep going through here. Alright. Well, I guess um, I'm gonna have to end this episode here. But next episode, I guess we're going out to fight these guys. It's mostly Skaven slaves. We got some good stuff for it. We can grab another grudge thrower. And that should be alright. We could also grab maybe the Ekron's Miners just to have a lot of blasting charges. But we just got a bunch more, so maybe we don't need it. I think we might just want more artillery. Because the artillery is doing a lot of work over a long time. So I kind of like that. I also kind of like both of these. Because the shield wall is sweet. Doesn't do much. Honestly, but it's pretty neat. Is there anything I wanted from these? Oh, I guess we should buff our rangers now that I think of it. So yeah, we, maybe we should do it like that. Reload time reduction for quarrelers and rangers. And speed and armor for quarrelers and rangers. We are the ranger faction, so maybe we should do that. Yeah, Alright, so I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.